Hi, my name is Anat Cohen, and I get to play the clarinet in this group. Uh, we're playing shoro music, and clarinet is typically playing the melody in shoro. And playing the melody has a lot of responsibilities in shoro because we often set the tempo by having a few notes ahead of the melody, so we create the atmosphere of the melody as far as the tempo. Often the melody has a lot of notes, so it's quite challenging and the melodies can be very fast. Uh, many times it's quite virtuosic music, but there are also some songs that are slow and very emotional. And I think the, what I love about Shoro for me, it's uh, just a perfect combination between being a classical musician and being a jazz musician, because you take a melody and you gotta play it. It's not about playing it perfectly, but it's about finding a way of making it your own, making the interpretation of the melody. And when you don't play the melody, and you get to play the counter lines. And the nice thing about the clarinet, that it has such a wide range, so I can play the melodies up in the high register. And then when, for example, Vitor is playing the melody, I get to play the counter lines together with the seven string guitar. So the clarinet has the options of doing both, and that's why. The next song we're going to play is called Ternura, which means tenderness, written by a clarinet player called Cachimbinho. The clarinet has a great history uh, in choro music and in samba music. There were great clarinet players like Paulo Mora, Abel Ferreira, Cachimbinho, Severino Araujo, Paulo Mora, and my friend Rui Alvin, who inspired me a lot. This song that we're going to play is one of the slower melodies, so I get to make interpretation of the melodies together with Vito. And when Vito is playing the melody, I'm gonna play some lines behind him. Bye. 